going on guys and gals of the internet welcome back for another episode of DIY Amateur Hour today we are going to continue going over the 2019 Silverado as some newer photos of the truck have been taken and putting out on the internet here you can see the truck is wearing a little less camo than it was in my previous video which you can see here in the top right corner instead of the canvas or fabric covering over the body it's all just a camo wrap or decal as you can see with that front grille it's still very Fordish to me um, but with this camo to me it looks very much like a ram so I feel very strongly that that's not the final version of the front end of these trucks but I guess there's only one way to tell and that's this fall when the trucks finally come out here looking at the side view you can see the mirrors are indeed mounted on the side of the truck again and instead of square wheel wells we have rounded wheel wells but they're also not perfectly round um, they have rounded edges but they're not they're not perfect circles obviously so they're kind of retaining a little bit of the Chevy character that sets them apart from different trucks you've got your running boards down there as well as if you look just over the fender, the front fender there, you can see that second body line over the wheel well that kind of slopes down under the mirror. That's a little bit of a different line than we've seen previously from GM. So I'll be interested to see how that flows into the rest of the truck here. You can see that cut out in the bottom of the bumper. I'll be interested to see what that's for. but. Again, you can continue to see the wheel wells, the camo and the taillights screams Ford taillights, but I'm sure that's just for camouflage purposes. As we continue around to the back of the truck, once again you can see that very large third brake light. So, And you also have the single exhaust, which indicates that this is probably just a LT level truck, not anything top of the line. Whether it's just because of the camo or because it's a test truck, this truck doesn't appear to have the step bumpers in the back, but I'm sure they will continue those on the 2019 trucks. So those are all the new clips for the 2019 Silverado that have been taken recently. As you can see, they're from MotorOne.com. If you appreciate this episode, please leave a like. If you want to see more content like this in the future, be sure to subscribe. And remember, you can always DIY.